And you are? My name is Allison Hartson. And you're representing? I am a Calif the California State Director of Wolfpack. Very good. Two minutes, though. We've already, thank you. already blown right. my Thank you very much. So, um, here. in addition to being the California State Director of Wolfpack, I am also a public high school teacher. And I'm here speaking today on behalf of the 60 plus people who traveled here from all over the large state of California because I know they can't each tell you the thousand reasons why you should vote yes on AJR1. I know they can't each tell you their heart-wrenching stories of how corruption and indifference directly impact their lives in painful and intimate and unforgettable ways. But you know what? They came here anyway, knowing that they can't speak and share their story with you. They made great sacrifices. They took the day off of work, all the people that you're looking at behind me. They took the day off of work. They drove hundreds of miles. They spent their hard-earned money on gas, flights, bus rides, and babysitters. And they did it because we've had enough. We've had enough of the corruption in Washington, D.C. They are here on behalf of the 9 out of 10 Californians who want our elections to be free and fair once again. From San Diego to San Francisco, from Los Angeles to Sacramento, from Santa Barbara to Eureka, there is nearly universal agreement that something is rotten in the state of our democracy, especially at the federal level in Congress. And we are all here today on behalf of the 96% of people in this nation who want our political leaders to reduce the influence of corruption in our elections. From Nevada to Texas to Illinois to Florida, Vermont, New York, people all across this nation who are waiting and watching and listening. And I don't mean that figuratively. Right now, people are listening to this hearing and they're waiting for your vote. They're on their phones and on their laptops, at work and at home and at school. We are here to tell you that we need a convention of the states. We've had enough. We're not going to settle for legislation. We're not going to cross our fingers and hope everything will eventually get better. We need an amendment because we've already passed laws at the state and federal level that the Supreme Court has overturned. We are counting on you to do the morally correct thing and vote in favor of the people by voting yes on AJR1. Thank, Thank you. you I told you. I told you it was worth waiting for, right? That was powerful. That was huge. That was Allison Hardson in 2014. 2014. That was with Wolfpack. That was before Bernie 2016 TV, this place. That was before Bernie announced. That was before the bulk of Americans even had any idea what was really going down. Right? That was powerful. And between then and now... Allison Hardson became a national director with Wolfpack, and now she's running for U.S. Senate to represent the state of California. And we have her here right now to talk to us about that. Al thank you so much for joining us, Allison, on We the People. Thanks for having me, John. I'm so excited to be here. Awesome. Thank you. And I, I apologize for completely destroying your intro. I, it's <laughs> no, it's happened. great. I actually love that you did that because it shows after I did my speech several people the volunteers who carpooled all the way down from san diego all around the state just one by one on the right side and the left side of the aisle came up and and talked about why they were there and pleaded for them to vote yes on that measure so it's a pretty powerful video it is and and so i mean i didn't really watch everything else that happened after that there's a lot of people there what what did the decision happen then when was when when did because you, you won i mean right yeah you won. Yeah, that was our Judiciary Committee vote in the Senate. And so we won right then and there. They voted. And then it still had to go to the Senate floor. And then we won that. So we were able to pass it through the entire California state legislature in 2014. All right. And let's, let's, this is AJR1. Let's explain yeah. to everybody what that is and why it's such a success that you were able to pass this. So... a. Wolfpack's sole goal is to get an amendment to the United States Constitution that will overturn Citizens United and related cases. And mm -hmm. if there's anybody out there who isn't familiar with those Supreme Court cases, um, I think everybody, most people in the progressive mm -hmm. movement are at this point, but it's essentially to get big money out of politics, to create a separation of wealth and state. And so the goal of Wolfpack is to do it through a United, United States constitutional amendment. And there are two ways to get an amendment. One is for Congress to 
vote on it, two thirds of Congress, or the states to come together at a convention, in which case the delegates at the convention voted out of the convention by two thirds, whether Congress writes it or the states write it, then you still have the states who have to ratify it or approve of that constitutional amendment before it becomes part of the constitution. And so Wolfpack is the only organization currently working on a convention or an Article 5 convention that is solely focused on getting big money out of politics. And so I, I hope that helps to explain it. But yes, AJR1 is uh, a measure to help get that convention so that we can go ahead and um, be able to get that amendment. That's awesome. That's awesome. And you've had success with, what, five states? That's right. And so part of getting that convention is you have to get two thirds of the states, which is currently 34 states, to pass a measure saying we're calling for a convention and we're calling for it on this particular topic. And so we have gotten five states so far. Nice. And I have it here, my first slide. See this? Here's the five states. We added some little icons to help you guys know what states these are. All right. Wait, let me click on it. I want to see what you're looking at. Oh, yes. There you go. So, <laughs> nice. I like the new California Republic one. I'm glad you got to use that. Thank you. Yeah, th with the weed. That's right. Uh, there's there's uh, uh, Janine Calkin on, on the Rhode Island flag. It's interesting. Uh -huh. um, Bernie on the Vermont flag. That's Vermont, if you can't tell everybody. It's Vermont. Uh. And uh, Chris Christie photobombed his own flag. Okay. You know, the only thing that the California one is missing is a face... A picture of Diane Feinstein terrified. Yeah. <laughs> we have that. I have that picture. I do have a slide. <laughs> so we've, we've got that covered, actually. Let's, just one moment. We'll, we'll show that. Mm -hmm. she